Hello you all techies out there. Would like to welcome you all on my YouTube channel White High Security. Here on this channel we focus on real technical configuration related to cloud, cloud security, network security and, and many more technical topics. So yeah, without further delay, let's get started with our topics for today. And yeah, I would like to thank you in advance for watching. Hello everyone. So in today's video, I would like you to introduce to a playlist or you can say a series of video which I'm going to create regarding Microsoft Sentinel. So as you all know, Microsoft Sentinel is a scalable cloud native SIM tool which stands for security information event management and as well security orchestration and automated response solution. So basically we are going to learn uh, all about this particular SIM tool in this particular video series. So if I talk about there are basically four pillars of Microsoft Sentinel which are collect, detect, investigate and respond. So in that there are multiple options like visibility, analytics and hunting, incident and automation. So this playlist is basically, you know, made around these four pillars. Let me quickly show you what, what is going to be the format of this particular uh, series of videos and you know what exactly we are going to cover. So if we talk about, we will start from part one, which is overview. So in overview, we will discuss, you know, we will start from, you know, what exactly a SIM is. Then we will move on to, you know, what exactly is Microsoft Sentinel, how it is different from, you know, other SIM product in the market and how we can use and utilize Microsoft Sentinel. After that, we will move to the collect phase. As you can see, the second, uh, the first phase of, of my or like first pillar of Microsoft Sentinel is collect. So we will move on with the collect phase. In that, we will design workspace and Sentinel architecture we will do data collection and we will do log management. So these three things which uh, are there in collect phase, we are going to learn. So we will learn how to create a log analytic workspace for Sentinel, what, what is going to be Sentinel architecture, how we collect uh, logs from different data sources and how to manage those logs. This is what we are going to learn in the collect phase. After that, uh, there is a part three, which is detect phase. You can correlate with the second pillar where analytics and hunting are the main things. So in that we will learn about anal analytic rules, hunting queries, workbooks, and you know, all that stuff for reporting and visualization. We will learn a little bit about the custo query language as well, which is the query language behind this uh, particular solution. After that, in part four, we will move to investigation where we will learn how to handle those incident on, you know, day to day basis. So how to get that tiny little threat information which is available into those patheras of logs. So we will we will learn how to do that, you know, how to respond to those incident, how to manage those, how to, you know, assign those to different teams and all that stuff. Okay, in part five, after that, we will learn about the automa automation or SOAR capabilities of this particular product. You know, how it can respond to uh, threats automatically based on, you know, logic apps or based on the automation rules. All those things we are going to learn in the respond part. Later at the bottom, you can see part six. These are some advanced topic which I would like to cover uh, like Mitra framework. So as we all know that, you know, Sentinel kind of a follows Microsoft uh, or not Microsoft Mitra framework. So each and every, you know, analytic rules or incident you can say is, you know, mapped to MITRE framework to get a better visibility, you know, on which part we are now being hacked or, you know, somebody is trying to compromise us. So basically each and every incident is mapped with, uh, you know, MITRE framework like initial access, command and control and all that stuff. So we are going to learn that, you know, uh, at the later part of this series. Similarly, threat intelligence and watch list are the advanced options, you know, in Microsoft Sentinel, which are going to, which we are going to learn at the end of this video series. So yeah, basically this is an overview of this, you know, particular playlist, or you can say a series of videos, which I'm going to create. So yeah, looking forward to see you guys in my upcoming videos regarding this Microsoft Sentinel playlist or, you know, series of videos. Any